Hi guys, Gary Spike Sullivan here. I recommend you subscribe to Sport and Icons for all your latest boxing news. Good luck. The WBA regular world champion of middleweight, of course, Japanese fighter Ryota Murata. He will be defending his title against Rob Brandt, and this will be on the 20th of October over there in Las Vegas. Now, Murata is crazy, crazy popular in Japan. He got an estimate of between 20 and 30 million people tuning in to watch him fight. That's more than what people tune in to watch Joshua fight. That's more than what people tune in to watch Canelo fight. I mean, okay, granted, so Joshua and Canelo are pay-per-view. Um, I don't... I have no idea if Murata is pay-per-view in Japan, but it wouldn't surprise me if he was. And this is one of the reasons why that um, um, Bob Aram of Top Rank was trying to make a Triple G versus Murata and in Japan as well, put it on pay-per-view, because that is some serious wedge, some serious, serious cash. Now, Murata, he's 14-1 and one, and a very, very good fighter. Now, he's one defeat. It was a split decision loss, but he did get revenge on that dude the very next fight and that opponent was Najikam and he lost that first fight in the middle of 2017 by split decision but then made um, Najikam quit in the very next fight in seven rounds so he's actually defeated everybody that he's been in the ring with now he's 32 years old and as I said he is crazy popular in Japan a very 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 good fighter and I know he kind of goes under the radar a little bit but ultimately I think a win over Rob Brandt an American on American soil as well is going to boost his profile stateside and maybe secure a big fight who knows and maybe against a Billy Joe Saunders or whoever it may be maybe the Canelo Triple G winner who knows who really knows now Rob Brandt as I said he's American he's 23 and 1 he's only one defeat was against Jürgen Bremer in the opening round of the World Boxing Super Series Super Middleweight Tournament. And he lost that one by um, points. Um, unanimous decision to Jürgen Bremer. So, of course, he is actually coming down from Super Middleweight to Middleweight to take on Morata. So, you know what? This goes to show, for any kind of fighters who's maybe offered the opportunity to go to the World Boxing Super Series, it doesn't really matter how well you do or don't do, if you progress to the next round or not, this puts a little bit of shine on your name. You get some serious exposure. And I, and I believe this is why Rob Brandt has got this opportunity. Um, of course, he, he does have to move down in this one. And maybe Bob Aaron, top rank, kind of see um, Rob Brandt as maybe a little bit of food for Murata to try and get a win on stateside. Potentially, maybe. But Rob Brandt is going to have to go there to try and upset the apple cart. And I believe that's exactly what he's going to try and do. But Murata has got to be the favourite no doubt about it whatsoever even though that uh, Rob Brandt he is a little bit more experienced as a pro of course he's had 24 fights compared to Murata 15 so you're talking like a nine fight difference but how much difference does that really make in the grand scheme of things probably not too much but if Rob Brandt can get a defeat or sorry can get a win over Murata and become WBA world regular champion that opens a whole lot of doors you know this sets up some potential big fights between him and the winner of maybe Jacobs and Devrachenko or B. Joe Saunders and Andrade or Triple G and Canelo. So this is a very, very good opportunity that Rob Bryant has got. Can he do it? Who knows? Maybe dropping weight is going to be a bit too much for him. But ultimately, I think that if Morata was to beat Rob Bryant, which um, he, he's definitely the favourite, no doubt about it, then who knows? Maybe a big fight after then. Now, Morata, he is a world champion. He's a regular world champion, but he goes under the radar. He does, but... Don't sleep on Ryota Murata. He's very, very good. So anyway, I'm just going to news out there for you all anyway that Ryota Murata will in fact take on one Rob Brandt. And this will be on the 20th of October over there in Las Vegas, Nevada. Drop your thoughts below. Click that thumbs up. Subscribe. Catch you all on the next video.